Today we will be assembling the MPO18 with optional storage and masonry chimney. Before you start, always check your local building codes. Next you'll need to make sure you have a sturdy foundation that is clear of dust and debris. The tools you will need include gloves, rubber mallet, drill, square, mortar bag, trowel, sponge, level, and mixer blade. Do not install when the temperature is below 45 degrees. Start by assembling the two sides and the back. Make sure to mortar all joints before continuing. Also make sure that the pieces are level and square and that the opening of the wood storage is at 44 inches. Next, you'll need to fill these with rebar and cement for reinforcement. Now that the optional wood storage is complete, we will start with the MPO18 installation. The two bases fit on top of the T-bar with the holes lined up with the back and the sides. Next, you line up the back of the dome with the two dome sides. For ease of installation, you should now lay your fire brick. You will need 16 split fire brick plus two split fire brick cut in half vertically. Continue by putting the front dome piece in place followed by the last two fire brick. If you are using the masonry chimney, start with the 4 inch starter inner liner piece and alternate between inner and outer chimney liners for the length of your chimney. The optional powder coated steel door is shown here. Once the unit is installed, you have many options for your finished look, including stucco, brick, or rock. Please visit our website at www.mason-light.com or contact us directly at 800-345-7078.